Hello, HWE uh, 1050. It is um, Wednesday, July 19th. So we just started yesterday, um, week eight. So we only have three weeks left of this semester. Um, that being said, I know that's kind of crunch time at this point because we have uh, we have a lot due within the last three weeks and we're kind of covering a lot. So um, rein in your rein in your horses here and get ready for this. Um, I hate to like cram stuff in at the end, but it's kind of just the way this cookie crumbles with the 10 week course um, or 10 weeks and this is a 15 week course. So we really, um, really are pushing a lot of material in 10 weeks. I am grading currently, I will grade your homework set number three that everyone turned in uh, Monday night. Biggie in week eight, um, we're covering two chapters again, so chapter 12 and chapter 13. Uh, so the micronutrients that are involved in ener energy metabolism, which is super interesting because there's lots of supplements out there that um, tout helping your energy or giving you energy. And generally they're revolved around um, the B vitamins. And so that's largely what we're talking about, but then you can decipher whether supplementation is completely necessary with the B vitamins or not after experiencing these chapters. And then the second chapter is chapter 13, which um, is looking at those micronutrients that are involved in blood and brain health. So that's kind of um, a neat topic too. The biggie though that I'm talking about, so two chapters, two soft chuck lessons, two quizzes. So just keep that in mind, that's a lot. Two chapters, two soft chalk lessons, two quizzes, but throw on top of it um, your three-day diet analysis. And so hopefully some of you have been working on that. And I apologize that I haven't even like mentioned it at this point. Um, and normally I do. I think this semester just caught me off guard uh, with how quickly it's going. It felt like we weren't in summer and then all of a sudden it warmed up and it's been hot. And then I'm like, oh yeah, it's summer. And now it's nearly the end of the summer. So um, three-day diet analysis, Big E project. And why I hold off until the end at this late injuncture is because we have then covered all of the micronutrients, the macronutrients and everything you need to kind of complete that assignment. And you'll see what I mean once you do it. So it's nothing that you haven't done before with uh, the NutriCalc assignments. Um, it's really just inputting all your information for three days. So you can use days that you've put in prior, um, but as long as there's three of them to analyze a breakfast, lunch, and a dinner, you are good to go. Um, don't hesitate to start this now uh, if you haven't already. It takes a long time. All I'm saying is don't wait till Monday night. You will be extremely frustrated with yourself on Monday night if you start this assignment because it is lengthy. It is not hard. And please ask me if you have questions. Um, really, it's just lengthy with what you're analyzing. So you're looking at macronutrients, all the macronutrients and micronutrients. So we've gone over. So um, it's kind of fun and it's a reflection of your, you know, your intake, your nutrient intake and where maybe you are potentially lacking. Obviously it's just three days, but it's a good snapshot um, of what your intake actually looks like. So that is coming up that we'll be doing a week. So please, please, please start now. And you will thank me later. You will thank me Monday night. Okay. Um, other than that, I think we're good. Keep rolling. You guys are doing great. I'm going to do some grades right now and um, get those uh, set three homeworks back to you. All right. Happy Wednesday to each of you.